I'm with my aunt or my cousins and we're talking to my abuela, like she'll be telling a story and my cousins will translate for me, but it's like a lot of the nuances are lost. You can't exactly translate it. It's like only something that a native speaker would be able to understand. Today, we're gonna step a little bit outside of our comfort zones and maybe yours too. Yeah, we're gonna talk about experimental music, like Frog House. We tried to see what weird foods people in Seattle have tried. Oh, alligator's good, but that's good. Fried alligator's good. Nettles. Like a, it's like a weed in the woods. Kick spring. If you just walk to different halls, you'll see, oh, this is a white hallway, this is a black hallway, this is maybe where Asian students hang out. Um, you could also go to the different clubs and find that clubs are typically racially uh, homogeneous as well. Many people have a ghost story they're waiting to tell. Stories that draw you in, not always because of the story itself, but because of the way it's told. We spent our Sunday afternoon searching for these stories. Here's a news clip from Yak Tri News from the Yakima Tri-Cities area, a broad speaking to students. The number one thing that I hear girls say about guys, they're all, they're all a bunch of jerks. And my question back to the girls is, who taught them to be like that? And I think girls do. So this next piece of material, like most good ideas, is fairly simple. It's just a list of people who ought to be killed. Okay? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold on, that's messed up. Well, sort of. But I still think it's pretty funny. What's up with eyebrows? Eyebrows on fleek. That little bit of hair that sits above your eyes, that has you plucking, waxing, or... Threading. We don't always talk about eyebrows, but lately eyebrows are becoming huge, commercially and physically. 